Hi there. In this video, we are unboxing and building the Powertech Deluxe Crosscut Table Saw Sled. This is a DIY project which you should be able to complete in about an hour. Included in the kit are instructions, two 19-inch HDP bars, a 24-inch T-Track, a 3-inch flip stop, a blade guard, and all the screws needed. The dimensions of the panels that you'll need to source are in the instructions. We chose MDF board for this project as it's cheap, smooth, and pretty consistent. Also, compared to particle board, it's not likely to warp or crack because of temperature or humidity changes. Before attaching the base, we pre-drilled and countersink. This is important as it helps to prevent MDF board from splitting as you drive in the screws. When attaching the T-Track to the front fence, position it closer to the inner edge. We use the table saw fence to help position the runners by measuring the distance from the first runner to the edge of the sled and then locking the fence in place. The table saw's miter slots are too deep for the runners, so we're putting coins down to elevate them. Otherwise, they won't make contact with the sled. Add the glue and let it set before screwing in the runners. This is very important. Before screwing in the runners, we pre-drilled and countersank. The pre-drilled holes on the runners need to be bigger in diameter than the screws. Otherwise, the runners will expand as you screw them in and then they won't fit in the miter slots. By this point, the sled is mostly complete. Have the guard box and the flip stop, and it's done. 